G'day guys, welcome back to the channel and we're going to kick it off with the VS Commodore. So, got this car in for closed door respray. The owner has done all the repairs on this car himself. He is a qualified beater, so it's made my job a bit easier. He's done all the repairs, brought it to me to take over from here. Uh, I've already gone ahead and primed all the, the front end of this car as well as the front doors. Now we've got the back door ready, the back quarter and the roof. It's ready for primer, it's taped up, it's ready to go into the booth uh, and we're ready to get the primer on, on this thing. So uh, enough chit chat, let's get into it. Alrighty, so now we've done the old shuffle around with the cars, put the VS in the boot. Uh, we're going to go ahead and pull plastic over this car now, cut it out, tape it up, and we're going to get this thing in primer. So let's get into it. Alrighty, so that's all done. Uh, the car's all taped off, masked up, it's ready to rock and roll. Um, so I'm about to head in to mix up my primer. I'm gonna walk around the car real quick and just give you a bit of an idea as to how I've masked things up and um, give you a bit of a look at it. So let's do that. Alrighty, so it's all taped up, ready to rock and roll. Um, it's a little repair on this door. Um, I went over that and finessed that a little bit. Otherwise, the car was basically rubbed down anyway. I just went over it with 240 grit. I've gone ahead and cleaned up all these channels in here because all the sealer was split. So I've cleaned all those out and I'll put fresh sealer in before I paint the car. Uh, there was a little rust repair that I had to do here. Um, it was pretty, uh, pretty different finding a bit of rust in a VS, but they are a 95 model car, so you know they're getting on a little bit. So it's probably to be to be expected now to find a little bit of bit of rust here and there. Now it'll start showing up, but as you can see, these repairs they were already done. Uh, I think I went over this one a little bit and just filled up a few of these nasty pinholes that were left. Um, but I'm not going to hold that against him, you know. He repaired the car and um, basically was sick of doing it. So dropped it off over here to let me finish the job. So we're ready to rock and roll for primer. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix that up and get into it. So that's it, uh, the VS is all primed. Uh, I've put four coats on this, so once it's all dried, I'll put a guide coat on it and uh, we'll be able to move on to the next step. So.
Alrighty, so we've got the rest of the uh, VS ready to get into primer. Uh, we've got the quarter panel ready and the back door. Um, the only thing left after this is the boot lid, but the boot lid on the car has a bit of rust around the um, around the lip, so we're going to replace that with the second Andy. Uh, so now we're going to get this masked up, get it in the booth, and we're going to get this primed up. Then that pretty much finishes up the body of the car. It'll be all in primer, and uh, we'll be ready to get onto the bumper bars and get them sorted out. So let's get it masked up. All right, so we're back in the booth. Um, car's ready to go. We'll pour masking plastic over it once again, bag it and tag it, tape it up, get it all ready. Then we'll mix up some primer and uh, we'll start shooting it. So let's get it done. So we're all done here. Um, I've put four coats of primer on the VS. Um, now it's all primed, ready to go. So the only thing left to do, I've got to do the boot lid because um, we're putting a second hand boot lid on this car. Um, it's got rust around all the, the boot lips. So rather than try and fix the one on it, we're just uh, going to put a good second hand one on it and paint that in and out and fit that to the car. 
Um, so yeah, that's it for this video. I'm gonna try my best to try and put a video out once a week. Um, so if you like the video and you wanna keep up to date with the respray on the VS, plus all the future videos on other cars that I'll be doing here in the shed, um, please subscribe, like, leave me a comment, all that good stuff. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys. Thank you.